Talk to us about the fashion, Mr. Davis is a fashion upper Kenya. So, Mama, what's the difference uh, between the other events that you have done of this and today's event? I think I've hosted so many events, especially on fashion and of course uh, runway, uh, talk of the, this kind of occasion. But um, I, I really uh, dedicated my time to be here and also to host this because when it's different when we talk about fashion, it's everything to do with fashion. So I dedicate myself and I say, okay, we're doing this. And um, we're not just, I'm not just a host, but also a partner in this. Um, as Waridi Foundation. Waridi Foundation is an organization that, um, that, that um, focuses and also advances on uh, sustainable development goals in Kenya. Yes, and also uh, Waridi is also coming here to represent the youth because she's the president of the Kenyan organization. Yes, 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 yes. 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 No, yes. No, the president no. last Wangare once in a while. <laughs> <laughs> Me, I have nothing else to say except cheers, and I'm literally waiting to see what you'll do up with Okoyo stage now, your mic, big time. <laughs> Generation Z, you wanna trade this video? So, you know, the Tom Yom's Mamma, you had to ask me that question. Surely, I told you not to find me like, okay, to try reject. I reject finance bill and um, I'm not a Gen Z, I'm a millennial, but also whatever is affecting, affecting the Gen Z, whatever is affecting the youth of today is affecting me too. So that's why unanimously we say it, we're rejecting the bill so that it can be amended or done with it and we get the best of Kenya because we, we, we are the youth, we, most of the youths that were rioting and, and of course demonstrating through Copa Angel, we are jobless. 